Or stage was name as Tembeka Blue. Uh, I am a poet, uh, a writer, and an LOV student. Uh, yeah, and I'm here to discuss, uh, well, to just tell you a little bit about my three favorite poems, which being uh, the first one is. He could love me rainstorm. He could love me rainstorm. Cleaning out all insecurities, a victim, this property is under new management. Requirements for new tenants include self-love and recognition of thy worth. Now he could love me rainstorm is like a narcissistic tone um take towards love. You well, know, most poets and they love poems are narcissistic in a way uh, so this poem is just a girl who literally wants to be the center of the universe of a boy who fails to acknowledge her, her existence or fails to see her as more than a friend blowing away and tearing down every form of love he's ever tasted let the taste of my lips be the ultimate heaven he never wants to leave. He could love me, Katrina. And number two is yesterday. So funny enough, yesterday, although it was, I think when I wrote it, this rape and gender-based violence theme was like reoccurring in my timeline everywhere actually and it i guess it was just in my head so um as i was in the bus and i was driving past on my way to bloom uh i saw two men like in the forest like burning something and i was like mm. i was like <laughs> yeah and the line goes something like this I was driving past the freeway, I saw two men burning a body. I did not see it per se, but something in the air so bad gripping my throat. Yeah, and it goes on like that. And it just explains how this girl um, basically envisions seeing a woman being burned to death after being violated. So, is this the message on gender, on rape and gender-based violence and how you can never truly silence the spirit? And then there's a third, my number three uh, poem is uh, Amabel. Now, Amabel is really special to me uh, because it's a really dark poem and it's about my late mother and how things just spiral out of control during her death. It has a little chant that goes Thank you for the platform and um, for allowing me to share my, my poems and sort of my story with you. Thank you.